All right, hey everybody, welcome back to another module. My name is Vic, as you already know. Good to see you back here again. How are you doing? I uh, hope you're doing awesome. You know, hope everything is making sense to you as you progress through these trainings, and you know, and and uh, you know, you're watching all these different you know methods of traffic generation, and hopefully, you know. Listen, don't let any of this stuff intimidate you. Don't let any of this stuff, you know, overwhelm you because I know we we you know, we're we're bringing you a lot of information, you know, a lot of different strategies, a lot of different ideas and uh and uh you know, and showing you different methods of traffic generation. Uh, listen, you got this for life, right? I'm here for you. You know, we're just going to keep this like we always do very laid back, you know, easy going, simple, just you and me just hanging out. Talking about traffic, talking about you know ways to get you more visitors to you to whatever it is that you're doing. You know this, you know high traffic. You know when, when, uh, when I was um, creating this this course, you know, and uh, uh, and of course as we progress, you know, if you're an elite member, you know the idea for high traffic academy brand, right, um, is not to bring you stuff that's outdated. You know, I the idea is to bring you stuff that's the most cutting edge, what's working now. Right, and most importantly, the most important thing is I want you to be able to implement some of this stuff or all of this stuff and get results. At the end of the day, if you're getting results, you're happy, and therefore that you know I've done my job and and uh, and I'm happy and everybody's happy. You know, your your wife, your husband is happy, your family is happy. You know, what? you're vacationing, you're you know you're living the, the lifestyle that you always wanted to live. It it's gonna start with traffic generation, you know, and so I'm um. In this particular module, man, I'm 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 pumped about you know the stuff we're going to be talking about today, uh, you know, in, in this particular segment because this is one of those cutting edge you know methods uh, to get traffic uh, to your website, right? Um, here is my advice to you. My advice is this, you know, and I and I said this in in you know some of the previous modules as well is treat this as a buffet. Okay, look at all this. You know that we're presenting to you here within High Traffic Academy as a buffet. You know, if if you if you if you go through a module and it you know it not you don't quite resonate with it or whatever, leave it for now, right? Do something that you resonate with personally. And I think this stuff that you know we're going to talk about in this module, I think that you'll be able you know you you'll resonate with this stuff because let me tell you why this is uh, very exciting for me personally is because <clears throat> I look at this and. And I can't think. I can't help but but think, you know, about the good old, you know, Google AdWords uh, days when I was getting started, and uh, and and Google AdWords was was you know was pretty cool back then, right? Uh, and uh, it was so easy to get, you know, to get um, in the top, you know, on the top, uh, you know, in, in in the top, you know, on the first page of Google for you know AdWords, and and I remember I was getting you know clicks for as low as eight cents and nine and ten cents per, uh, you know, per visitor. Right to my side, and 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 I was I was scooping a lot of money at that time, you know. But then Google slapped everybody around a little bit, you know, and 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 you know, and and right now, you know, it's pretty difficult to to you know to get up there with and employ with Google. So that's why I was telling you know, for for the time, you know, I was not doing any traffic generation through Google, right? But it is the nine you know nine hundred pound gorilla, or whatever you want to call them, right? That's out there in the marketplace. That's you know, if we can break through to them, and if we can utilize, if we can if we can leverage Google to get traffic your way. Here is the thing: we've figured it out, right? And uh, and when I say we, you know, personally, I am. This is something that I'm also going to be implementing in my business. So literally, what I'm presenting to you here in this module is the most cutting edge stuff that is working right now that is pretty virgin territory so that's why I'm very excited because you are going to be amongst the first people out there in the marketplace okay uh, <clears throat> that that you know will be able to explore this territory uh, and uh, uh, we're going to be talking about traffic methods that potentially you know can get you you know clicks or traffic or visitors to your site for you know again I can't Quote you any numbers, you know, specifically here, uh, but potentially for as low as you know five to cents to ten cents per visitor through Google, right? Through Google networks, and we're talking, we're going to be talking about video ads, okay? YouTube video ads. And YouTube, you know, is um, I think Gideon, would you, would you? Uh, um, I, I haven't checked my stat recently on that, but I think uh, YouTube is the second or the third most searched or visited site in the world. Is that is that right? Yeah, it's <clears throat> it's an interesting one. Uh, it's just last time I checked, at least uh, within the last 
uh, month or so, uh, it overtook Facebook as the most visited site in the world, so, or, or the, the most visited social media site at least, I guess. So it overtook right. Facebook, so it's bigger than Facebook in terms of a social media site. And of course, it's the, the second biggest search engine after Google, so it's, um, it's pretty much up there. <laughs> Right, right, right. So, 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 so it's leveraging that to get to get ten cent visitors, right, and and you know up to eighty percent click through rates, and and that's the kind of stuff we're going to be talking about right now in this module. So, what I suggest you do, listen, what I suggest you do is grab something to write with, right. Take notes, pay attention. Most importantly, apply this stuff in your business because this is new stuff. I'm learning this. This is one of the things that I'm going to be applying in my business, and I want to bring this to you, you know, at the same time when I'm applying this in my business. So this is literally the most cutting edge stuff. Now you say, Vic, how are you going to teach me this stuff? You know, if you know, if you if you're just going to be exploring this for yourself as well, well, you know, I don't want to be the guy who is going to be teaching you from just theory, right? So here's what I did: is I went out there and I looked at, you know, and I said, okay, who is the best right now? Who is literally the best at you know, video ads. Who is the pioneer? Who who is who is the authority on the topic, right? Because my vision for High Traffic Academy is not to bring you stuff like I said that's outdated. We want to be playing, you know, with the most cutting edge techniques, right? And so uh, Gideon Shelwick <clears throat> is the guy that rose to the top, you know, in my research. And uh, and you know, he's he's the guy that I've been watching from the sides for you know quite some time now. And uh, and he is uh, the most leading authority on the topic of video ads and so what I was able to do uh, uh, fortunately for you is uh, is uh, you know I, I contacted Gideon and I said Gideon look here's what we're doing you know High Traffic Academy we want to bring the most cutting edge strategies for traffic generation to our group would you be willing to hop on with you know with me and do a uh, you know and talk about this stuff and bring this education this material to, to High Traffic Academy members uh, to you right so that you can learn this stuff and be among the first people to explore this territory and really capitalize on this you know if you if you know anything about you know I mean it's it's it's, it's about being in the right place at the same you know at the right time and taking action right and uh, um, and, and and maximizing you know it's, it's figuring out what to do right getting it to work and then and then uh, scaling that up as soon as you as soon as you can as fast as you can as big as you can and capitalize on this wave of opportunity because it is you know one of those most cutting edge techniques that you can apply in your business right now. So I'm personally very, very excited. What I'm going to do is, you know, if you have never heard of uh, Gideon Shaw, Gideon, what's your, uh, uh, maybe give us a little bit about background about what you do because I know you're, you're like the video king out there, you know, for traffic generation and, you know, and I've been watching your stuff and, uh, uh, you know, first of all, I appreciate you getting on here. Um, thank you. So maybe give us a little bit about the background about what you do, you know, how you got started and, uh, really, sure. why, why, why video is your vertical? I mean, why, why sure. did you choose that? And you know, kind of take us through that a little bit. Sure. Well, it's it's certainly been a bit of a journey for me. Thanks for the introduction, by the way. Um, uh, Vic, I uh, appreciate it. I'm not sure if I'm the, the, the world's leading authority when it comes to video ads, but you know, we all stand on the shoulders of giants, and I'm still learning. Uh, it's still one of those people just. I keep on learning, you know. And there's there's so much to learn about these things. It's so exciting, and it's a changing industry. But that's you know that's what's so cool about it. Um, there's always something new to learn, and always something new to implement, and and always new opportunities to take advantage of. But you know, the journey started for me about uh, about eight or nine years ago uh, when I was uh, back at a job, uh, great job, but um, I just wanted to do something else with my life. I wanted to start my own business. Uh, we immigrated to Australia from from New Zealand. Uh, started the business, and um, it was an online business. I wrote a book, sold the book on the internet, and and did pretty well. And uh, and then I ran out of traffic. I didn't know how to get traffic. And um, and I'll, I'll I'll go through that a bit in my presentation as well. I don't want to let the cat out of the bag too much, but basically stumbled upon video as as a, a really cool way to uh, not only communicate online but also to uh, to build an audience and to build trust with the audience and and to to use that for building a business on and um, so I've, I've done pretty well in the past with 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 using video. It's probably been about six or seven years that I've been focusing just on YouTube and and, and video in particular, um, and it's it's really been a, a big blessing for, for me and my business and and also everyone else that I've been that I've been teaching over the years. So you you you've definitely put in your ten thousand hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've. I've 
I didn't count them, but um, I've certainly done quite a few. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, and, yeah, and you know, one of the things that, that, that is fascinating to me, man, is just how humble you are about, you know, this whole thing, uh, and, and, and that, that, that speaks volumes to me personally, because uh, I know there's a lot of guys that, that are not doing anywhere near, you know, as much as what you guys are doing. Uh, you know, with with video and and you know and and they're just loud and 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 stuff. But what you do is you're actually out there in the trenches. You're actually doing. You're actually running stuff, and uh, and and you you're the you're the guy that actually created the system around this concept. Even though this is a, a virgin territory, this is this is mm. like like if 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 people are not taking advantage of this right now, I, I think they're crazy because you know like in the next. Two three years probably there's going to be a lot more people taking advantage of this stuff and and you know and obviously I don't know if it's going to work as well as it is working right now, right? But as of right now, you know even though this is a fairly new concept, um, you created. I don't know anybody else that 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 has what you have as far as like a, the actual system, which is something we're going to talk about as well in this video. Uh, you know that you created. So um, let's talk about. You know, let's talk about this concept of video ads and really what, how does that work? So, you know, one of the things guys, that that you know, the reason I told you is take notes is because you will be able to uh, look at this and you'll be able to apply this in your business. Go out there, get results. Okay, and so, um, and one of the things that that we're also going to talk about is um, if you know, if you want to really expedite and simplify the, the, the whole process, right? We're going to talk about the actual system that, you know, I was able to bring into High Traffic Academy for you to leverage if you wanted to do that. Uh, that's just going to really take things to a whole new level for you. So I'm, I'm, I'm personally pumped. So uh, with that being said, I, I don't want to take too much time, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, your time, Gideon. So why don't we just go ahead and dive into this and, and walk us through, <laughs> you know, how are you able to get these uh, 5 to 10 cent clicks? using All right. uh, YouTube. All right, so I've got a little bit of a, a presentation and um, you know, by no means is it is the be-all and end-all of, of, of video ads. So just, you know, if, if you've got any questions, uh, Vic, uh, just stop me and I'll, I'll, um, I'll do my best to explain. It's a bit of a presentation, just takes you a little bit on a journey, uh, my own journey as well, um, and then uh, talks about uh, you know, how, how video ads actually work. Um, and some problems with it, and then how you can fix those problems. And so I'll be introducing you to uh, a really cool system, as you say, or we like to call it a platform um, that you can use to to help you with that. Um, so um, I'll just dig straight into it and um, and and, s and see where, where that leads us. Sure, sure. Okay. So let me share my screen. Okay, here we go. So you can see that all right, uh, Vic? Um, that is uh, coming up. Yep, I see that perfectly. So you're good. Uh, okay, great. So, so the title I have for this this presentation, once again, it's it's not the be all and end all. It's uh, it's it's really just a guideline for us to to have a chat. Um, but it's it's all about how to quickly and easily get traffic from YouTube video ads. And you know, I've got the word cheap in there. I don't particularly like the word cheap, but it's you know affordable traffic. And you know, Vic mentioned the days when we were able to get like 10 cents uh, clicks or 18 clicks with with Google, and it's almost like we're, we're back in those days again, except now it's with YouTube uh, video ads. Um, <clears throat> so let's let's dig into this and, and let me show you how this works. So let me just kick this off with was asking you a uh, some questions. Um, first one is, you know, do you also want traffic? And that's like a no-brainer. Everybody wants more traffic if you're online. So I'm assuming your answer is yes to this one. Um, and maybe you've tried some of these things. Uh, Vic mentioned, you know, a bit of a smorgasbord that you guys have available there. So, so perhaps you've you've tried some of these things already. Um, one that I'm very familiar with is is free traffic, or also known these days as you know content marketing. Um, maybe you've tried that, but you're really struggling to get any kind of traction. Maybe you're submitting content all the time, but you know no one is watching your videos or no one is reading your blog posts. So maybe that's not working for you right now, uh, or maybe it is, but you're struggling. Uh, maybe you've borrowed some traffic, and you know some people call it uh, joint venture marketing. This is where you find someone else to promote your stuff for you. Uh, very popular in the internet marketing or online business world. Um, but perhaps there you're struggling to find joint venture partners to promote your stuff. You know that's one of the biggest challenges there. Um, maybe you have tried paid advertising, uh, like AdWords, of you know, uh, like Vic was talking about, or even Facebook at the moment, Twitter. Uh, there's a whole bunch out there, but you're struggling to get a, a nice positive return on investment. 
um, or it's just to complicate it. You know, if any of those sort of things, if you've, if you've had any of those sort of issues, um, you are going to love this presentation because uh, it's going to rock your world for this new kind of traffic. So inside, I'll, I'll reveal um, how we're using YouTube's latest video ads to help you get up to 80% click-through rates on your video ads and really very affordable traffic as a result. Um, and also how you can do this uh, using a brand new method, a very, very simple method. And, uh, you know, I think this is one of the things that I, that I really love about it. Um, it is, out of all the traffic things I've tried, it is the simplest. Um, but you need to know the navigation, you know, otherwise it can also be complicated. And I'll show you. Um, what's also cool about it, there's no need for, um, you don't need to be a keyword research. It's a little bit of keywords. Um, practice uh, needed there, but you don't have to be a, a full-on expert for that. Uh, you don't even need to know anything about video editing. In fact, you don't need to create your own videos even. We, you know, I'll show you a way to, to totally remove that from the process. Um, I mean, in fact, if you can type and click and drag your mouse, um, you're really qualified to, to do what I'm about to show you. Um, before we get into it, that's actually, that's, that's actually a really good one because I can almost hear people saying, "I'm not good on video, man." You know, but that, that's actually really good to hear that you don't have to be yeah. on video. To yes, do this. Awesome. yes. No, it's so so true. Um, and and that's one of the things that we we thought about as well. You know, it's like, okay, video ads are cool, but so many people they might know about it, they might have seen it, but they're thinking mm, it's not for me because I've got to create a video. So we found a really nice solution for that. Uh, so let me share it with you. Let me just get back to my screen. Okay. So you can see my screen again, right, Vic? Uh, coming up, yes, sir. Okay, good. So before I get into it, I'll, I'll just show you how I, you know, how I stumbled upon it because I, you know, I've tried a bunch of different things, and um, I think it's it's nice for you to see my journey because perhaps you've been on something similar. So I started about eight years ago, as I said. Um, the biggest issue being online has always been for me to get lots of really targeted traffic. You know, that, that's always been the number one issue. Um, and of course, turning that traffic into leads and customers. But it all starts with traffic. Um, so my first traffic source that I tried, with, uh, played around with was with my mentor, uh, that first book that I wrote. Um, he also became my, my first joint venture partner, and he promoted my my book for me, my very first product online. And you know, we had a lot made a lot of sales. Again, I want to say a ton. Um, for me it was a ton back then. I think I made I think it was fifteen hundred sales or something like that, um, in total. Um, now to me that was you know, a lot of money just starting out. Um, and I was very, very excited uh, when we were doing this. Um, but then <laughs> after that, <laughs> nothing, you know, um, the traffic completely dried up. Um, I didn't have any more joint venture partners. I didn't know anything about content marketing. I didn't know anything about paid marketing, uh, paid advertising, and I was kind of stuck. And um, it took me about two years, really, uh, before I was able to figure out this JV game or just trying to get traffic online. And then finally, um, you know, I, I, I managed to get some success for that. Um, and you know the JV traffic, the joint venture traffic, where you get someone else to promote for you, is really awesome um, if you can get it. You know, if you can get it, it, it really is awesome. Um, but it also has its own problem. Um, you know that I found, and you know it can take a long time to build those right relationships. Uh, once you have them, they're amazing. Um, but it can take a long, long time for you to build enough authority for people to trust you and to know that that you've got a good product to promote, etc., etc. Et and you know, traveling to meet people, all those sort of things. It can take a lot of time. Um, now, it can also be very risky. A lot of people don't realize this, but JV traffic can be risky. Uh, for example, if you know if you're running a big launch and you're getting like ten really big big um, partners to promote for you all at the same time. But you didn't do a great job with with testing your conversion rates on your on your sales page. You can get all that traffic and the whole thing bombs, um, or it might bomb for any number of different reasons. And um, you know you end up with not a very good experience for your joint venture uh, partners. And also a lot of people who see your product not converting very well or <laughs> you know um, getting a lot of egg on your face. So so it can be okay. risky in that in that sense. And I hear you. I see you nodding. Uh, Vic, <laughs> sounds like ah, you've yeah. got some <laughs> experience. Been, been, there, been there, done that, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. 
All right. So, and, and really, it is like a drug. Um, you know, when you're on it, it's it's pretty awesome. But when you're off it, it you you know you can you can. The problem is you can become quite dependent on it. Um, if you only have JV traffic uh, for your business, you become dependent on it. You know, and every time you need to make more money or, or make more sales, you need to go and um, tap on people's shoulders to say, "Hey, can you please promote my stuff?" And 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 that can be. That can be quite tough, especially if your previous launch bombed. <laughs> you know, people are less, less likely to promote for you. <laughs> See, this is this is this is the big thing that a lot of people don't realize is a lot of these so-called gurus that's out there, right? When they do these big, you know, multi-million-dollar launches, they rely like almost a hundred percent on JV traffic. Like, mm. very very few of those so-called gurus really generate their own traffic. They're 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 like you know they have their own little circles that everybody promotes each other. So. Yes. Um, yeah, very, I mean, very creating your own stuff is is very very important. How to you know yes. know how to do and, that? Uh, to I totally agree with you, uh, Vic. And you know, this is uh, creating creating uh, what I'm going to show you today has the, the motivation, the big motivation behind it has really been to to move away from that dependence uh, of of uh, JV traffic. In fact. My first days of being on YouTube, that was the motivation for going after YouTube and using YouTube as a traffic source as opposed to um, joint venture traffic. Because, you know, I started with joint venture traffic and it worked really well. But I found it, you know, it was, it was um, I became dependent on it and I was, uh, you know, I wasn't able to really build a sustainable business. And I, I needed something else. So I did very well with free traffic from YouTube. But, um, of course, today's presentation is about, um, you know, uh, paid traffic with, with, you, uh, with YouTube. So... Let me um, let me share with you what else I learned. So yeah, so JV traffic can be can be a bit like uh, a drug. Um, so then after that, um, basically alongside that, you know, um, alongside JV traffic, I also tried uh, content marketing, or you know, basically creating a lot of free content, put it out there on my YouTube channel, put it out on my blog, uh, the guest posting, you name it, you know, uh, any anything. Where you create free content to drive organic traffic to your site, and I did pretty well. You know, I got um, a lot of uh, exposure and traffic, and I wouldn't be where I am today unless it was for that. Um, it certainly played a big part. But <laughs> um, if you're just starting out, you know, it, it takes a lot of time and effort, a lot and a lot of time and effort. You know, if you if you're building a YouTube channel, it, it could take up six months to a year really before you build traction. Um, if you're lucky, you can. You, you can you know some of your content might go viral and you you know within a month you do very well. And in fact, with the, the 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 magic channel that I did a few years ago, that that was one like that where within a month or within three months we had a lot of traffic. But in general, what I see is that it can take a long time and a lot of effort to do to do well. And of course, time is money, and the game has changed also since since uh, since I was doing that back then. Um, so yeah, it works absolutely, uh, unless you're in a hurry, <laughs> unless you want to get traffic fast. Um, and really, you, the the other thing that I've learned over over my last eight years online, um, and I'm sure you'll agree with this, Vic, is that you really are at the mercy of the latest Google algorithm fad, uh, Google and YouTube algorithm fad. I mean, YouTube just changed the algorithm as, as well over the last two years. Where they there's no more. It's it's for a very long time now. It's not more. It's not about how many views you get. You know, it's. It's now more about how, how well you can engage your audience and how, how long you can get them to watch your video and stay on YouTube as a result. So they look at very different factors now. And, you know, for people who played the system who and got a lot of fake views, you know, all those videos are gone now. All those channels are, are, are not ranking anymore. So they're um, they're cleaning up. Yep, they're cleaning up, which which is a good thing. <laughs> you know, they're 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 trying to keep people straight with you know eliminate all kinds of shenanigans that people were doing. That's Oh, absolutely, and and they have leveled the playing field, which is really good. And it's it spells actually, you know, just on that topic, um, it, it means it means anybody, if you create great content, can compete, which is which is really awesome. Um, but yeah, it still it still takes time. Um, the next thing I tried was paid advertising, and I, I mucked around with quite a few things. You know, I tried uh, banner ads that really <laughs> that really didn't work well for me. Um, we had so many impressions and very very few clicks. Um, and you know we, we paid for impressions for for our banners, um, and sometimes for clicks as well. Um, AdWords, uh, the trouble there, you know, when I started using it, I was a bit late, so we just struggled getting a good return on investment. We we could get traffic, yes, but it was just so expensive, um, and I had to get someone else to run it for me because it was too complicated for me. Um, <clears throat> Facebook, um, now Facebook um, is certainly 
probably the number one uh, paid traffic generation source for a lot of people at, at the moment. So, um, you know, there's certainly nothing wrong with getting Facebook traffic. For me personally, um, I, I gave it a shot um, and I still want to give it uh, more attention. But I got quite confused with their power editor and stuff like that. So I think for me, it's just a matter of playing around a bit more to make that work for me. Um, but at the moment, you know, I'm just a bit confused by all that. Um, so all of that stuff is just too hard for me, <laughs> and, and I didn't really get any significant results for them. And you know, it probably has to do with me being a, a video guy as well, uh, and 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 you know, video stuff appealing to me a lot more. Um, you know, and I got just totally confused with all that. Um, and it was, you know, massive learning curve. All that stuff, massive learning curve. So I finally stumbled upon on YouTube paid ads. It's been around for a while now, but I, I started looking at it more seriously at the start of this year. And um, I thought, hey, you know, there's something here. Um, there's so much traffic on YouTube, and so very few people are doing YouTube ads and even talking about it. There's got to be something here. And so I started playing around with it, and I just fell completely in love with it. Um, you know, at first I struggled a bit to figure it out, but I studied it, did experiments, and once I figured it out, I thought, hey, this is, I've got to show this to the rest of the world. It's actually a lot simpler uh, than anything else I've tried, and, uh, and, I, and, I, and I want to show people how to do this. Um, now, what's awesome about it is that traffic on YouTube is still very cheap. It still is very affordable. Main reason for that is because uh, they have a massive oversupply of um, ad inventory. You know, they don't have enough advertisers to fill all their advertising spots. So because of that, it's less competition and um, more traffic, you know, cheaper traffic available. So yeah, as a result of that, it's it's less competitive, which means your uh, the traffic you can get from it is um, a lot more affordable. And of course, you know, it's backed by Google, um, who, you know, who owns AdWords. So they know the game, they know the ad game, and so they're applying those same lessons they've learned from AdWords to video ads now, YouTube video ads. Uh, and it's still being run through um, AdWords, but it's slightly different, and I'll show you in a second um, how, that, how that all works. So j just to get back to this 80% click-through rate thing, um, I know it sounds a little bit crazy, um, but let me share the actual result um, for that. It was, it was our best case study, and also more, more typical results of, of what we've been getting. Um, so these are just some of our own tests. Um, so this was one. Uh, for that this particular test, we had uh, 237 views for that particular campaign. Um, the cost per view was about seven cents, um, and we got uh, 190 clicks for that particular ad. So if you do the math, that's about an 80% click-through rate. Um, so clicks over views. So I, so what that means, if I can just get my face back on here, just to sort of emphasize the point. Excuse my. Lighting here, it, I think it flickers a little bit every now and then. But um, so, in other words, 80% um, of people who watch our video ad go ahead and click on it. So these, you know, these click skippable video ads on your videos in front of YouTube, right? So you, I'm sure you will have seen it. Um, most people just click on skip. You know, they don't want to watch the ad. This five, you get five seconds, and the skip button comes up. They click skip. In our case, for this example, 80% of people watched past that skip button and actually went ahead and clicked on our video ad and visited, uh, visited our website. So I just wanted to make sure that that's 100% clear. So, so people come into your site, there is, think of the, guys, think of the psychology behind, like what's going on there, don't, don't just, I, I want you to pay attention to, like, and, and, and fish for the strategies here, right, because to get 80% click-through rate, see what happens is that ad that people watch, 80% of those people watch the ad to get to the call to action place, right? And so by the time they're entering your site, they are pre-framed for whatever it is that you're going to show them. So the quality of the traffic is super, super high. It's, it's probably some of the highest quality traffic you can ask for. Yeah, that's a really good point. And, you know, it's, it's, it's that whole thing of um, commitment consistency. If, if someone's made a certain level of commitment, they're much more likely to be consistent uh, in their actions to that commitment. And so this very much plays along that line as well where if they've watched 20, 30 seconds of your ad already, by the time they get to your site, they're already kind of committed to to what you're doing. And so theoretically, uh, it should be a lot better quality traffic that you're getting uh, as a result as well. So there's a lot of cool stuff with, with video, which, which you don't get with just text-based ads. 
uh, or image-based ads because for those, it's just a bit of text. They click on it and they go straight to your site. There's no no real time commitment uh, for them before they get to your site. So that's, that's a very, um, very valid point there. Thanks, Vic. So that was... Um, that's been our best. So that's been our best case study. Uh, I'm not saying that you know you can get it every time. We certainly don't get it every time, but it's certainly been our best one, and that's uh, you know what's possible with with some of these ads. Um, here's an example um, with a click through rate. Um, it probably wasn't as high. It was still pretty good, but the the what I want to show you here is um, we we ran a split test. Um, the top one you see here is a video. Um, the actual video um, that was created. Um, the, the blue one here, the top one. Um, it was uh, one of our co-founders, co-founders who created this ad for for one of his other businesses. I think he said he spent about between two and three thousand dollars for the ad, and it took about two or three weeks to create that ad. Now look at the the video just below that, the the light one, the the white one with some text on it. That one um, took less than twenty four hours, and um, it was a few dollars to create that particular ad. Um, now look look at the towards the right, where we have the views column and the website clicks column, and you'll see that that both examples got pretty similar number of views. Uh, the top one 396 views, and the bottom one 333 views. But now look at look at the website clicks column, the one to the the red um, rectangle on the total right. Uh, the top video, which cost like 3,000 bucks or 2,000 bucks, only got 39 clicks. The bottom one took a lot, was a lot faster to create, and a lot cheaper. 131 clicks. That Everything is, else was the same. That is amazing. Yeah, everything else was the same. And you know, the, this this um, more expensive video was not. Um, it wasn't a bad video. It was one, you know, a very professionally made video. It was one of those explainer type of videos. But as you can see, um, it's not necessarily how much money and uh, you spend on a video ad and how fancy it looks uh, to get you the results. You can, you can with some very simple strategies, which I'll show you. I'll, I'll actually show you what we use um, to to get you know a much much better result. So, so that was a pretty cool um, case study. Um, here's one from from one of our users. Um, so he was using this uh, you know video ads to um, some get some pretty good clicks. Um, and, and look at that. He's got got a he's listed his conversion conversions uh, uh, um, column there, and and that's the conversions in this case is leads for a, a webinar that he was uh, promoting for one of his clients. And he told me that he was paying between twenty seven and thirty eight pence, I think it's called, uh, per webinar registration. Or if, if you translate it to dollars, it's fifty five cents per webinar registration. Um, and so this is once again from YouTube ads. So it gives you an idea for you know what what. So this was Tom Breeze from uh, Viewability. By the way, Tom is is amazing with this stuff. He is really really good, and he's one of our top advisors for for uh, our business too. Um, and um, so so you know I guess it's just point towards what is possible uh, with with this sort of stuff. What's cool about this? The best part for me is that it, it really is super easy. And I, I really believe, especially if I can do it, anyone can do it. Um, and we've really tried to make it as simple as possible. And you'll see in a second what I mean exactly. Um, why does it work? Why does it work so well and, and why is it so effective? Um, there is a reason behind it. Uh, it didn't happen by chance. Um, we've basically spent a lot of time and money just figuring it all out, You know, figuring out what works, what doesn't work. Uh, we've done a ton of study. We've done a lot of experiments ourselves. Um, we've consulted with some of the world's top experts. I mean, I mentioned uh, Tom Breeze. Uh, we talked to Tommy Powers, um, amazing guy. And, and Vic, you should probably get those guys on as well. Um, uh, um, Jake Larson is also amazing with the stuff. Daryl Eaves. All these guys um, has had an input into helping us develop this and, and making it as, as awesome as possible. Um, and also, you know, just for me and, and for our team, there's about um, seven or eight of us working on it, depending on, on, on when you're looking at our team. You know, we're drawing from all our experience with, with YouTube marketing over the last, last eight years that we've applied uh, to this system. And, you know, we've created a very simple paint-by-number system for you to follow as well. Um, now, 
if you had to set this all up manually, uh, it would seriously take you forever. And before I, I show you that, uh, let me just, I just want to quickly go over how this thing actually works. I mean, you guys in this forum, um, as members of Vic, you know, you'll get on this, uh, you'll get advertising, you'll get paid advertising. But I just want to sort of summarize it with this really simple diagram um, and how video ads work. So basically these little dots, circles on the left, that represents the audience on YouTube. And there's like, I don't know, three or four billion views, unique views on, on YouTube every single day. It's something crazy like that. I can't remember the exact number, but it's, it's insane. And your job as an advertiser is just to grab a portion of that, uh, your target audience. So that's what I've, um, I've drawn a little, is it a trapezium shape <laughs> around your target audience? So your, your, your challenge is to figure out who those people are, or at least what they're watching on YouTube, what, they, what videos they're watching, what channels uh, uh, they're watching, and, and target them. And from there, you get them to watch your, your ad, which is sitting on YouTube. And from there, they click on your ad and then visit your site. So we like to send people to a page where we, we grab their contact details. And there is a disclaimer that I'll go through in a second, but you know, it has to meet AdWords requirements. You can't just send them to any page. Um, and then, of course, once, once we have people in our system, we can present our different products and services and offers to them. But that's really... You know, every time I get confused, I just come back to this image and go, this is, this is what it's about. And your job as, a, as a, an advertiser is to think about how do I target my audience? How, how do I get them to watch my ad? How do I get them to click on my ad? How do I get them to, to sign up for my, um, to become a, a lead in my business? And how do I get them to become a customer? That's really just, that sums up everything. So um, if you were going to do this manually, um, you know, this is how you would do it. And I won't even go into the full process because it, it, it might, um, it might be, be too painful to watch. <laughs> but um, let's, let's say, um, let's use an example. So I'll, sh I'll show you one of my businesses is called uh, Splashio. And I'll use this as an example throughout the rest of the presentation. So if I just zoom in a bit here. So this is a typical landing page that, that we send traffic to. And um, this is one that, that YouTube actually accepts or, or, or AdWords, they, they don't have any problems with this. Um, you know, there's a few things we do here. We've got a navigation structure. We've got a contact us page. Um, it's not just about getting the lead. Um, and, you know, we have navigation down the bottom, the bottom of, the, of the page as well. So there's, there's a few things happening here that's important. But the key thing here is to get people's contact details. And, and so this is all about, you know, helping people make their videos look really good. And we've got a free report here that helps them. So what I want to do now is I want to find videos and channels on YouTube that, um, that people are watching who will be interested in my product or service. So a natural kind of keyword phrase that comes to mind um, is something like you know, video production. So just on YouTube, I would search for other videos on YouTube called video production because I know that you know, if they're watching videos on video production on YouTube, they're likely going to be interested in making the videos look nice, which means they're going to be interested in my product uh, or my. So, you know, the so thing this is what. <clears throat> so this is what you call. This is what you call your targeting process, rather targeting phase in, in the process. Right. Um, there's there's many different ways of, of targeting uh, people on YouTube. Um, we're just keeping things real simple, and this is part of the the shortcut we found. Is you know we we don't even worry about keyword targeting or demographics too much, or um, or topics or interests. All we do is we ask the question: What videos are people watching on YouTube, and which channels do they watch on YouTube? If right. we so know pretty, what, what pretty, pretty logical thinking here right now. Yeah. Yeah, and because we know, you know, by default, we know that if they're watching a video that's related to my my business, they're gonna be very a very um, targeted prospect. You know, it just it just it doesn't even matter. You don't even need to necessarily look at the age or, or gender. You know, if they're watching that content, they're gonna be a targeted prospect. Right. So in this case, you know, I can now see. All right, there's a bunch of videos here. I think YouTube gives you the top twenty. Results. In fact, I think this is my this is my video here. Haha. <laughs> um, I'm on the first. <laughs> I didn't even know that. But um, anyway, so I can now just think. Okay, 
um, cool, I want to show my ad in front of all of these videos. Um, so there's 20 here. Um, so the, here's the first problem. Um, for you to be able to show your ad in front of these videos, you need to have the individual video links. So the way I would have to do this manually is I'd have to go right click, um, uh, copy, I said link address, yes, and uh, let me open up my text document. Let me just make this nice and big so you guys can, oops, don't want to print. Make this a little bit bigger so you can see what's happening. No, so I might, I might type in, okay, there's my first video that I want to run my ad against. All right, well, oh, that's just one video, okay. All right, so let's go through the process. And now here's the second one. Boom. And here's the third one. And I'm just assuming here that all three of these videos are, you know, good targeted videos. And it's based just on that, that keyword phrase that I used there. So I've got three targeted videos there. But, you know, depending on your, on your niche, three videos might not be enough. I mean, heck, 20 videos might not be enough to help you get enough audience uh, or a big enough audience. What if you want to scale? Maybe you want to have 100 videos or 500 video links. Um, I'm, I'm sure you can see the problem here already, just trying to find these video placements. Because yeah, I was gonna my, my my next comment or my next you know question is would be is like how many how many of these videos do you typically want to have or video links in a campaign because there is you just you just typed in one you know one keyword right that logically thinking that people would type in you know in your niche but there there could be variations of the, of the keyword which will bring you know other you know uh, other videos uh, and and you can you can just you can you can you can flip through those keywords and and potentially build yourself a huge list. Now, how what how many of these you know videos do you typically target per campaign? Okay, um, it depends on the niche and, and also how how many views a particular um, set of videos are getting. If it's a, a mainstream kind of topic where the videos that you find get a ton of views, you probably don't need as many. Um, but in general, what we do um, because most businesses are more niched um, is we uh, we try and get as many. Uh, video links as possible, and on on the um, uh, the AdWords interface, um, they limit uh, the number of video links you can have per target to 500. So if you're doing just video uh, links, you can have 500 per target, but then you can have 10 targets per video mm -hmm. campaign. Mm -hmm. So which means you can get 5,000 links in a campaign if you wanted to. So yeah, once so again. Right, so if you're going after the, you know, like the videos that rank it in the top first two or three pages, mm -hmm. and, and usually those videos have like thousands and thousands and thousands of views. Some of them are into tens and hundreds of thousands. So you could, you put, you put, you potentially, it's like it's like doing a TV, you know, infomercial for like super dirt, dirt cheap because you're literally getting in front of that kind of big of a yes. crowd. Awesome. Yeah, it's it's it, it'll be cheap and it will also be extremely targeted because once right. again. You know the people who watch those videos, they're interested in the content, they're interested in that topic. So exactly. as long as your ad is is aligned with that interest, you know, your chances of them watching the ad and clicking on your ad is going to be so much higher. Um, and a lot of people don't get this. They they just think, all right, let's just create my ad and put it out there and and get a ton of um, get a ton of views, but it's from all sorts of people and not very targeted. And so then they complain, hey, it's not working, uh, or um, people, nobody's clicking on my ads. But you know, if, if you get your targeting wrong, then of course that's what's going to happen. Um, but the other thing that I that I'm I'm not going to go into here because I just want to I don't want to go too long with this. But you can also target channels uh, on YouTube. So you can target a whole channel, and of course when you target a whole channel your ad will show to potentially all of the videos on that channel. And once again, you can have up to 500 channel placements per target uh, in your, in your um, campaign, which is pretty cool. So, so that's something I call Ninja. <laughs> right. Um, yeah, so, so for example, uh, sometimes we get, get some of our customers that only target uh, uh, video placements, and, and then um, for whatever reason, it's not a big enough market or they're not getting enough views. That, that you know it doesn't quite kick in for them, and then we say, well, try targeting a target in the same niche or the same you know keyword phrase or set of keyword phrases, and then often when they do that, um, it just opens up the market, and the traffic is normally a little bit more general as a result, but it opens it right up, and then from there um, you can uh, you can see what works and what doesn't work. 
So, but let's get back to this. Um, okay, so, so you can see the problem here. I mean, it's it's pretty cool, but the problem is if you want to get a lot of links, um, it's you know you're either going to have to hire someone to get all these links for you, or um, or do it yourself and just spend a lot of time on it. And this is just for one keyword phrase. You know, what if what if I want to have something like, um, you know, web web video production because that brings up a different set of results. In fact, I think my yeah my video comes up number one for that particular keyword phrase. So different you get different results here, and some keyword phrases might be more targeted than, than others. Some some might work better than others. Um, but the problem is, you know. <laughs> getting those links <laughs> it can be quite tedious um, so that's one thing people struggle with um, so even if you can find these uh, these links the next challenge that people really struggle with and I'm just going to show you one screenshot and you'll you'll get immediately what I'm what I'm about to say um, it's the video editing you know creating the actual video ad um, if you if you've never done a video before um, this is daunting Thing. Even if you're not doing it yourself, you're trying to think about creating video ad that actually works. So you're going to spend money on these ads, and you want to make sure you create a video, a video that converts. And for most people, just getting started this with this, they have no idea. Right. This this is actually a good thing, Gideon, because because of of this process, this this leaves a lot of people. It, this kind of pushes a lot of people away, mm -hmm. because people don't want to do this kind of stuff. You know, and not, not not very many people know how to put together a video ad or. Or do video yes. editing, or, or you know, take the time to go through it. So that's actually a good thing for for us. Okay, keep going. Sorry, no, I didn't mean to interrupt that. Exactly, uh, and, and that's a fantastic point, and and which is cool. Um, so so if if you're, um, you know, if if you're keen to make this happen, and I'll show you the shortcut where you don't even need to create any of your of your videos yourself. You don't even need to own any video editing software to be able to do this. Um, you know, you have a massive advantage. Um, but I just wanted to show you this picture. This is a video that I edited myself, but I mean, this one took me a long time. Um, professional setup. If I had to find someone else to do this for me, it would have probably cost, you know, I don't know, hundreds, if not thousands of dollars to to create a video like this for me. Um, I, this one I did myself, but it took a long time, you know, a lot of time, and that's that's an opportunity cost for me. So, um, so that's what you do. So you, you, you so just to summarize there. You know, you go to YouTube, find your target uh, video placements and channel placements, and then you know create your your actual video ad. It's quite a tedious process. And then once you're ready with that, then you can go into AdWords and and submit your ad. Um, and I'll, um, so I'm not going to show you the AdWords stuff yet. I'll, I'll show you something else cool first. So it's it's a it's a pain um, to do that manually. And of course, yes. Now, did, did 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 you? I just I just missed it. Did you say you are going to show where to place it in, in Google yes. AdWords? Yes, I'll okay. show you exactly exactly all the settings that we use um, and the shortcuts we use for for doing that. I just want to show you the <laughs> the difficult way first. Um, and you know there are people right now using the manual process and doing very very well, um, <laughs> but um, <laughs> they don't need to struggle that way. Um, but they probably don't know about the solution that I'll show you in a second. Um, I mean that's an option. That's an option for somebody who has you know a lot of time and and you know and they're and, and they're okay with doing video you know uh, production yeah. and that kind of stuff. So that's that's right. you know one way of doing it. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, there's there's no problem with with going through that manual process, um, but it it is just slow. You know, it really does slow you down. And you know, so the, the sort of things you could um, come up with is you know your competitors, if they're using something with you know with a shortcut like this. Um, and they've got more money and a much larger teams. You know, you're, you're kind of in trouble. Uh, you know, you, you have to compete against those guys. You know, what if you really want to start scaling things for yourself? If you want to find, do a lot more campaigns, run a lot more ads, um, it's going to slow you down. Uh, what if you're doing this for lots of clients? Like, if you've got ten clients and each one of them wants to scale it, um, you know, how would you prevent yourself from getting totally overwhelmed? Um, you know, you really need something because otherwise, it's it's just really going to limit yourself tremendously. Uh, when you do it all, all manually, but yes, you can do it manually if you want to. Um, so that's you know that's why we've got um, this the system or platform that we call Vroll. This is the the business that um, I created. These three uh, co-founders. I'm one of them. Uh, I'm here in Australia. The other two co-founders are in 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 Singapore, where our uh, development team as well. So we created this platform um, that helps you uh, quickly create video ads 
that work and also helps you with, with the targeting. Um, there's three really easy steps and you know I'm a three point kind of guy, I love keeping things simple. Um, to help you make this work, first of all, um, the system helps you find the perfect audience using channel and video placements very quickly and I'll show you and I'll share the actual demo in a second. Step two is, is to help you create the actual ad that converts like gangbusters without using any video editing software. I mean you can once again but we've, we've got some cool templates that you can use. Um, and then you just submit your, your video ads to AdWords. That's it. Those are the three steps. And once again the secret sauce for all of this is that we only focus on video and channel placements. So once again you can get totally confused here with all the different targeting options blah 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 mm -hmm. and I actually did that and it actually reduced um, my results. My results went down as soon as I started focusing on the other targeting options. Um, there are more ninja stuff that you can do later on but when you're getting started with this video and channel placements will will take you a really long way. So you're, you're focusing on the 20% part that's going to produce 80% of the quality traffic that you're really looking for at the end of the day. It might even be better than that. I mean, I, it's, it's difficult to put a number on it, but I would, I could almost suggest it's the top 4% that gives you mm. 16 times the result. So that's still part of the 80-20 rule, but it's just an right, example. Right, because you're, 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 you're eliminating, I mean, you're literally cutting out all that, all that, not, all that fat, you know, from, from your campaign and just really going for the, for the heart of the, you know, of the best of the best, the cream of the crop, right. so to speak. Yes, right. and once again, I mean, if when you apply just logic here, you know that when someone's watching a video about a particular topic, you know, they by default they won't watch that video unless they're interested in it. So by default, if you know that, and you put your video ad in front of that, and it really appeals to that same interest, it's it's going to rock. It has to, you know. Sure, sometimes there will be people watching a video and then they're not actually interested in it. They just clicked on the on the wrong link or whatever or whatever but you know nowadays YouTube is so good with this that they're providing very very accurate results so your chance of getting a very targeted audience is very high uh, when you do video and channel placements um, so yeah it helps you get super targeted views and it just it just simplifies the whole process it just really just makes it simple so let me show you the actual demo now for you know if you want to <laughs> speed things up a little bit um, so this is the V-roll interface. Let me just go to the dashboard. So when you log into a V-Roll, this is, it, it looks something like this. You've got a dashboard that shows you a quick overview of everything. But I'll, I won't show you everything. I'll just go to the targeting tool. And, and here you can search for both channels uh, or, or videos. Um, and I'll just do the video one for now to give you a feel for, for how all this works. So similarly, I'm going to target the same business, Splashio, same thing, same target audience, you know, I'm assuming they're watching the same content, etc. But now I'm just going to use V-Roll to help me do this. So I'm going to type in, what was it, uh, video production and hit the search button. And now what V-Roll does, or the monkeys behind V-Roll, goes and look at YouTube and says, all right, what, what are the top, not just 20 results, but the top 100 results? coming up for that particular keyword phrase. And what's yeah. more... i got to tell you, your monkeys work really fast. <laughs> yeah. um, we, you know, we're using the API with, with uh, YouTube's API, so, so that's why we're able to do this. But, you know, this little ninja button here that some people miss, but you can, if you want to, you can get the next 100 results if you wanted to. We, we just, for starters, we're just saying, okay, let's just grab the top 100 videos. Um, but now instead of individually grabbing these links, what you can do is you can just select all of them, and go um, either get video links, and there they all are already um, copied to your clipboard, ready to rock. Uh, or if you want to use them later, you can go. All right, let's let's save this now as a an actual uh, target list. So we'll call this video production, and we'll call it videos because it was a video search. So I'm going to hit save target, and that should save it in my targeting list now. It's loading. I think let me just go back and see. So I go back to my target list. All right. Scroll down. Hopefully this worked. Slowly. Yeah, okay, so there it is. So you can see that there's the video production list and there's a hundred videos in there. So if I click on that, it'll it'll just show so me the results. That, that right there just literally took you like four seconds to do. 
Well, exactly, yeah. So they're all there. I don't have to right-click and put it on a text document, blah, blah, blah. So very quickly, uh, you can get video links here. And this is particularly useful for niches where you do need more videos to help improve increase those number of views to help you get more clicks because some some niches are just smaller than others and you need more videos and and so finding videos here just just solves this this completely um, and same thing here you know you can just select them all and um, get the links boom just copies it straight to your to your clipboard so now I've got my my links and you know I can do more here I can I, I recommend um, I mean, if I recommend you you start with a higher number of videos, like we, um, for a keyword phrase, depending on the niche, I would I would normally go with just 500 links, and and see how it goes. You know, just see which ones work and which ones don't, and it's very easy to turn the ones off that don't work. You just you just pause the the videos that that don't work, or if they're sending unrelated traffic, you just pause them, and you you keep the ones running that are doing really well. And I'll show you in a second. If there's time, I might I might show that as well, but. Um, the next thing to do is once you've got your target is now to create your actual video ad. So we've got this little um, function here where you go to create and then um, we have, at the moment we've got one, two, three, four, five templates to choose from. And I'm not sure if you remember, if I go back to this example here, this, this split test, the bottom video here was created using one of these templates. Okay, so we have five to choose from at the moment. We are um, we're about to submit another five or six uh, templates, and um, our goal is to const constantly add new templates. But this is we're just getting started with this. Five templates here, and they're all text-based ones. Uh, with, you can choose some music. Say I like the modern computer one. Um, it'll so, show you. Oh, let, me, let me ask you this, Gideon. While you're, you know, sure. showing that this, this is, I mean, amazing stuff. Amazing stuff. Which you read. I mean, that's that's why I wanted to you to to. That's that's why I wanted to bring you, uh, so that we can, you know, we we can open the doors to, you know, to to high traffic academy members here. But let me ask you this. So before you guys roll out a new template, do you do you put it through some sort of a, a testing process? Do you do you test it, you know, for, you know, is that does it convert well? You know, is there what's the process that before you you know add it to the B-roll yeah. uh, template library? Yeah, sure. It it, de it depends a, a little bit for these ones. Um, they certainly were tested before we made them available because they are our very first templates, and we wanted to make sure that they work. Um, what what we what they're all based on is uh, a set of um, psychology rules. Um, uh, it's a combination of um, uh, very powerful psychology, uh, persuasive psychology, uh, plus um, the actual visual visual elements of the video, plus the audio uh, elements of the video, and then finally plus the timing of when things happen. You know, all those things play together to make up these templates. You don't have to actually think about all that stuff that happens behind the scenes. All you right. have to do is, I'll show you in a second, type in five lines of text. I, I, I love that. I love that. So you're, ba you're basically just eliminating all the, all the you know the burden on the user. You know to you know if somebody don't, if if the user doesn't really understand this, the whole psychological aspect yeah. of of creating a compelling yes. you know high click through rate video, uh, you yeah. literally just give it to them. So awesome, cool. Yeah. So for these ones, they've certainly been tested. Um, there's this one that uh, we're just about to release that helps you drive traffic to um, your subscription, your YouTube channel page to help you get more subscribers. It's based on the same psychology. So. Um, our members really want it, <laughs> so we haven't been able to really test it. So we might just make that one available in any case. And, and the reason we might not test it as thoroughly is because it's it's based on the same structure and psychology of these ones that we know definitely work already. And if you know if it doesn't work for whatever reason, people just won't use it, or we'll we'll take it off, or we'll improve it, whatever reason like that. But also sometimes um, we get requests from our customers that they want a particular thing, and they're not necessarily all that interested in conversion. It's more about just building a brand, and they just want to be out there and they want it to look nice. So we, you know, in those cases, there's not much point for us to test it in terms of views and clicks, and it's more about giving our customers what they want. But for these ones, certainly these first few ones, they've they've definitely been tested to help you, um, you know, to help you get the results. Oh, you know, we do whatever we can basically to remove the moving parts and to help you get the result. Um, for example, the psychology and the timing and the visual stuff and the sound stuff, it's, it's all built in there to already help you. Um, but the next step, this is, you, you do need um, uh, a little bit of, I guess, intelligence here. Let me just refresh this page. I'm not sure why that video is not showing. 
it must be because I'm trying to do too many things at the same time. Anyway, yeah, okay, so there we go. So I've picked the modern computer one. And here, so this is literally for these particular templates, all you have to do is five lines of text. And we've got some suggestions here of the type of content you can put in here. Five lines of text, 40 characters each. So if you can essentially write five lines of five Twitter messages, you can do this. <laughs> um, so the first line, grab their attention. Second line, maybe create some intrigue. Um, third line is uh, present your solution. Line four is you make it really awesome or you have some other kind of benefit or uh, some other kind of a psychological trigger. trigger. And then finally, you just get them to click. Ask them for the click. And I'll, I'll just type in an example here for you that I created early, earlier. So this is for... This is an actual ad that I created for my video video business. I'll just press this in and I'll read it to you so you can get just a, a bit of a feel for what a typical ad might look like. And, and while you're doing that, let me let me let me let me let me let me tell you this as well. Um, uh, obviously, you're watching this. Is you know, th this is um, so what what we're talking about here is you know it. There is traffic generation, but there is also understanding how to write persuasive ads, right? So it's not just, you know, we have, there's there's other modules we have specifically dedicated. I'm sure you saw that. You know, if you didn't, I suggest you really go back and, and, and look at that. It's how to how to write and communicate persuasively uh, to your target audience. Uh, and if you, if you apply that training and that education to this type of stuff, right, I mean, you, you can have... Unbelievable results. So, just yeah, a little yeah. side note there. Absolutely. If if you know a little bit about copywriting, this is going to help you a lot. We do also have a a, a whole. It's like an hour long training on just how to write these five lines of text <laughs> inside our inside the members area. So so if, if you're not a, a pro with that, you don't worry. We 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 take you through that step as well. So this is probably the only place where you've really got to think a little bit. Um, but you know, from here, um, when you hit submit. Actually, just read, I'll read the, the actual example for you. So this is for, for getting people to this Splashio page here. Um, so it goes like this. Also hate how long video editing takes. Don't worry, there's a much easier way. No need for fancy video editing software. This new free report shows you how. And click here to download it now for free. Simple as that. Just quick. You know, grab their attention. Um, build some intrigue. Talk about a benefit or a free thing you're giving away. And, and call them to action. Boom. Done. So you hit submit. Now at the moment, um, I'm just going to hit yes. Um, this doesn't get created automatically. Uh, this is still our MVP or our minimum viable product. So later on down the track, we may, may make this completely automatic. So at the moment, this is still a, a manual process for us. There's, there's actually somewhat a real person behind the scenes who will make sure everything looks awesome and create the whole the actual video for you and then send it back to you within. We try and do it within 24 hours uh, during business days. Um, but you know, once it's back, you'll get an email, and inside your dashboard, um, you'll get the actual. You know, will it'll be uploaded to YouTube. So it'll be like, you know, here's uh, here's the one that I you know I've created it previously, but it's it's the same kind of thing. This one is already done, um, and you'll get the link. So so there's your video ad now. So I'll I mean I'll um, let's see. I haven't tried this with Google Hangouts, uh, Vic, but. Let's see if you can actually see the ad if I play it for you guys. It's only like 20 seconds long. There it is. Don't worry, there's a much easier way. Yeah, and there's there's I don't like I don't hear a sound because you know your pro your sound is probably going through your headphones. But there is a, a sound right with that. Yes, so this this sound with this we have music options to choose from. Um, for this, you can actually hear the typing, so that there's there's a lot of um, reasoning behind this. You know, draws people in. They want to, and it creates uh, an open loop. They want to see what what's getting typed uh, in this particular template. So there's a lot of stuff happening here behind the scenes. A lot of people don't even realize it. But that's kind of what it, what it looks like for that particular uh, template. You know, what we're gonna so, do, man. We're gonna our people. High traffic academy folks, we're gonna dominate this thing, man, and, and it's exciting. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. This is really, really awesome. I'm pumped. It, it is very cool, and what what is awesome about it? You know, like, I, I mean, I know as an entrepreneur, I mean, you, you can probably relate to this as well, Vic. Every time you come up with a new idea, um, you know, you ask yourself this critical question: um, Is it going to work? You know, is is what I'm doing um, actually going to work? And and will I be able to help other people? get results too. 
And so that's what's been so exciting is we've, we have been able to make it work. We've been able to get those really good conversion rates, the really good split test that we ran with that expensive ad. So it works. You know, that's the bottom line for us. So, um, so we're very excited about, um, you know, growing this thing. So, so we're pretty much done. So we've, we've done this first two steps. So now we've, so we've got the, the target. There's the target. We've got the link for our actual video ad. Um, now the only thing that's left is to go into AdWords and create a campaign. So, I mean, if you like, if there's enough time, I can quickly show you how to set up the campaign as well, um, Vic, with some Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, go ahead and walk us through. Um, like, I'm, I'll be like the, the, the most, you know, the, the, I'm the newbie here, okay? So uh, walk okay. me through how to, how to do that. That's All right, so, so you, you need an AdWords account for this. Um, and uh, um, so, so log into your AdWords account and then... They're still hiding it. This is the other thing. It's if you look down the bottom left here, I'm not so, even sure so, if you can. So so I'm a, I'm a, I'm a total total newbie. I just got started. I just got I just literally got online yesterday, man. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, oh, where, where do I go to create AdWords account? So you just go Google.com, right, and just type in Google AdWords, and it's a free account that you create. Yeah, you can create it for free. Um, obviously, to pay, you've got to pay for actual ads. You know, you pay per per view and on uh, for for YouTube ads. Um, right. But you can set up your account. So you need to, I think, connect up your bank account um, with with your account. Um, but it's pretty quick and easy to set it up. And once you've got the account, you're you're all set. Um, and we're actually working on another feature inside VRault. I've seen the. Um, the draft version of it, I can't show you guys yet, but basically we call it a campaign builder, which means you don't even have to do all the stuff I'm going to show you now. It, it all gets done inside the viral campaign. You just press a button and you just upload a file to AdWords. Boom, and you're done. Hit submit and you're done. But anyway, I'll show you the manual process now in any case because it's still manual at this stage. So, down the, so once you log into AdWords, um, once again, they hide it. So this is the normal AdWords interface, super confusing. <laughs> but then down the bottom left here, this is all video campaigns link, and you, you've got to click on that to get to the the AdWords for video, or uh, video YouTube video ads. So it uses a very similar platform, but it's different, um, and the way we use it is is a lot simpler. So it takes a wee while just to load it. Um, so here we go. And even here it loads a little bit. Even though you've got a fast connection, it seems to be quite slow normally. Um, so this is just my test account, so don't take too much notice with what's happening here. Um, but let's uh, decide now. Let's say, okay, we want to create this new campaign. So I'm going to hit plus campaign. And um, wait for it to load. And then all I have to do here is give it a name. So I was going to call this uh, Splash Show homepage because that's where I'm going to send the traffic. I can decide how much I want to pay. So let's say, just for this example, I just want to pay ten bucks a day. Um, and you know, here you can. I recommend you start with something small just to test it. Maybe ten dollars is, is enough. Maybe twenty dollars is, is more required. Once you've got it working, then start scaling it up. So it's your daily budget just just start small and then scale it up later. Um, we found with this sitting here, this is a bit of a ninja one. Um, you can test this as well. Um, what we do now is we just automatically change it to accelerate it. So that means your, your ad shows as quickly as possible. And for some reason, that helps us get get the views and easier and, and, and better. So we, we make that selection there. For the networks, we turn off uh, search because we're, no, we're not doing YouTube search. We're only doing the, the in-stream ads, the, you know, the ads that show up in front of other videos. And we also turn off the Google Display Network because that's just we found we get very irrelevant results there. So all you want there is YouTube video, uh, YouTube videos for the networks. Locations, I, I, I normally recommend um, you really select the countries here um, that you want to target. That's that's quite important. So I might only want to target the United States. Uh, there it is. Um, right, so if you advertise in a country that is not English speaking, you don't really want to, like, like if your people don't speak English, there's no point in, in showing an English ad in front of them or vice versa, right? So you, you, you want to make sure that people can understand what you what you're telling Correct. them in the video. Yes, right. and, and also if, if you just select all countries, then you know, you're know you potentially going to get a lot of very untargeted views, which is not going to convert for you. So you want to make sure you target countries where people are speaking the language that, that your ad is in or that or the, you know, people speaking the language that you're that's also your target market. So for right. this one, so I was what, doing. What yeah. what are you? Yeah, and you you just about to say that. Well, I was gonna say what I usually do is just select five English speaking countries: United States, yeah. you know, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, and UK, right? 
Yeah, that's right. And you can, I mean, we add Singapore as well because they speak mostly English there, and, and you know, it's it's a business kind of country. <laughs> so, um, uh, but exactly, that's the, pretty much those five or six countries that we do for English speaking. Um, absolutely. But I mean, you um, you can. This is the beautiful thing about this. If if you're a local business, you can go really local with this. You know, you can go city based. I I saw. Here's a really cool idea. Um, you you can, for example, if um, target Los Angeles, say, and then create a video ad using V-Roll that starts off with something like, hey, um, hey, uh, hey, Mr. Los Angeles, or hey, uh, Los Angeles resident, I have something interesting for you. you know, or, 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 or how about this, if you live in Los Angeles, check this out, right? Exactly, yes, exactly. So then you only show it to people in Los Angeles, so you know that only people in Los Angeles is going to watch that video ad, and then if you have that, that that call to action at the beginning there. Um, if you live in Los Angeles, you need to watch this. That sort of a thing. You know, your conversion rate will be so crazy high. Um, it's it's not even funny. I actually saw this. Um, See, with, what, uh, what my what, what I'm what I'm thinking right now is like with this type of targeting and with this method, it opens up an opportunity for people who understand this to not only be able to drive traffic for their stuff, but be a consultant to other even offline businesses that don't understand any of this stuff. So you guys you guys see where I'm, exactly. where I'm coming from? So you learn this strategy, right? You learn how to use this thing, right? Get traffic for yourself, but you can also be a consultant for other businesses because of the you know of, of what the you know the targeting allows you to do. So yes, exactly. All right. So so it's moving on. Um, so languages, so I think it'll it'll Try and figure that out uh, uh, by default, but you can also select the languages there if you want to. Uh, normally, by default, it's just English for for me for for the targets I have. Now here, um, you can add your video, your video ad. So it is optional here, but I you know I recommend you already add it here. So now you can go back to V-Roll and grab that little link. So there it is. If I just click on this little link here, it copies it to my clipboard. And let's go back here and just paste it. Boom! There's my video ad. And now you'll see it'll pull it in. Automatically, and there's your ad. So now YouTube recognizes your ad. Um, this sitting here, um, we just use the default video ad formats. Um, we just leave that as it is. Now, very important, we turn off the in display one because we don't want to have in display for this. We're just doing in stream. That's all we do here. Um, now, if you display URL, in my case, it'll be www.splashio. All standard stuff, and then um, my destination URL, which would has to be it has to be on the same um, uh, website. In my case, it's, I'm just sending it to the home page. I'm not going to change that. But if it was a different page on the same domain, you know, it could be forward slash I don't know landing .html or whatever. You know, for me, it's just it's just the home page. So um, I'm just going to keep it like that. Now here. You can also upload a companion banner, and I do recommend you do that. I don't have a banner with me at the moment, but um, if, if you upload your own banner, this is very cool. On the right-hand side here, you'll see that your companion banner will show up there on the right-hand side next to the video. So even though they might skip your ad, your banner will still sit there right throughout the whole video. How cool That's is that? Amazing. That's a strategy. Yeah. That's awesome. So I really recommend you you upload your own little image, and you can you can you know you can put a nice call to action there or whatever um, that relates to the content of this video. I mean, there even there you can be very specific with what you do with that particular banner. Um, all right. So in display is turned off, uh, and and then down here uh, we leave the scheduling as it is. Um, delivery frequency capping. Now depending on what you're doing here, you see can change this. Um, you can limit the campaign so it, so it only shows a certain number of times to any to a unique user per day. Um, in general, we don't worry about it too much. Um, but if if you're concerned that your if you that your ad might show too often to people, and they might be turned off as a result, you know you can limit this. So maybe you want to do it just like once a day um, for each unique user. But it depends on how big the market is. If it's a small market, you know. Maybe you don't want to do this. If it's a, if it's a bigger market, maybe you do. So so test with this as well. But um, it's not too big a deal. This one. The the important one here is the device targeting. For now, 
Um, for the mobile one, we want to decrease that by 100%. So all this means that your ad won't show up on mobile ads for now. Yes, you can run these on mobile ads as well, but uh, you need a slightly different call to action, and we're working on some templates for those as well. But um, And we haven't really tested them as much, but um, and we will. Uh, but for now, if you reduce that by 100, it means your ad will only show up to uh, people on desktops, which is exactly what we want. So this is where they click on the ad and they go to your website. So yeah, you can you can control where your ad gets shown. This is this is where you you know you guys watching this. This is where um this is where HDA Elite stuff comes in. You know, really 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 useful because as you know as there are new features and new strategies and new updates coming out and new algorithms. You know, that's that's where we stay on the most cutting edge. Like you know what. What's gonna work like six months from today, right? That's where that's that's why I highly recommend. I keep keep saying this over and over again. And if you're not an HJ Elite member, it, it might be something you want to check out because this is where, you know, as uh, Gideon, as as you guys come out with new stuff, you know, add to the system, you know, we, we get you on that, you know, on, on on the training and and you know you walk you walk through, you know, what's what's the latest, like what's working today, what do you need to focus on today? Yeah. Absolutely, and um, you know that's that's our job. You know, at V-Roll is to stay at the forefront, see what works, what are the latest developments, and create tools and strategies for our users um, to get great results. Because we, I mean, we know that if our, our if our customers get awesome results, they're going to stay with us and they're going to talk about it, you know, to their friends and and, and and colleagues and stuff. So, you know, it's that's why you know we want to make sure that our customers get awesome results, and so that we make that our focus to to be on the cutting edge. Um, but that's it for this page. So we're going to hit save. So not nothing rocket science here. Really simple uh, the settings. Um, okay, sorry, I had I already have one called that. So let me just change the name. Um, didn't accept it because I had exact. You know, I've previously set up a campaign with the same name. So just want to. Now, are you able to split test your ads at this time, or is that not possible yet? Uh, for sh sh sure thing, you can you can um, uh, at, at this stage you you can add it. Next, uh, a little bit later. So for now, you can just put your own, just one video in. But I'll, I'll show in a second how you can add another video. Uh, so you can run split tests. You can run ten videos at the same time if you wanted to. Cool. Okay. So we're going to hit save. So hopefully that I don't have another one called exactly that. I don't think so. All right. Cool. And this is the second and last step for AdWords, um, and this is for your targeting. So here, I'm just going to call this for this target um, video production because that's the keyword that I used and it's for, for videos and for here I just want to start with say five cents my bid um, you can you know we start with five if we don't get views or anything we, we normally increase it to like 10 cents or 20 cents just to see what happens and then once we start getting views we bring it back again to, to whatever the lowest we, we can but start with five see what happens um, and, and and then tweak it as you go now here um, gender it depends on your market. If it's if it's only male or female, you know, obviously you want to select that. For us, it's it's everybody. Um, I normally turn off the 18 to 24 and over 65s, just because for our particular audience they're not very targeted. Um, all the other stuff here, like the interest and stuff, is just confusing. We don't even touch it. The only thing we do here is under this little narrow your targeting thing, click on the drop down box. Once again, there's a few options here, but we ignore everything except this one, placements. That's where the magic happens. So here, what you can do now, you go back to V-Roll, and you get your links for your placements. Now that's your magical have, list. Now. My <laughs> magical list, exactly. And that should be on my clipboard now. And now I can just go paste. And that's now pasted all 100 links. For my placements there, done. So now I just oh actually you need to down the bottom make sure you click on. Um, sometimes there we go. Uh, just make sure you click on add all, and make sure that they, they they appear on the right hand side there. So now all all the video placements are in there. You click on done, and you are done for that particular placement. So if I click save targeting group now, what will happen next? Is it'll go into the YouTube machine or AdWords machine. Some monkeys will look at my ad and make sure that it's all good. And once they're happy with it, approve it, and then I'll immediately start getting views and traffic. 
So it generally takes what about 24, 24 hours, 48 hours for, for them to approve your ad. And um, sometimes it's a lot sooner. It probably just depends on demand, uh, you know, and how busy they are. But so, sometimes I've had it within the hour that it, that it's ready to rock. Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, leave leave 24 hours. So I'd, I'd say to to just be sure. So it says here not serving, you know, at the moment. And um, if there's any problems, they'll they won't approve it, and you'll if you have to fix it. Um, but if it's if it's meeting the the AdWords uh, requirements, you know, for for your landing page, then it'll just get accepted and and you'll be ready to rock. Um, so I do recommend, and I'll, I think I might cover it a bit later on. But you know, if um, AdWord AdWords uh, landing page guidelines, if you just Google that, um, I think the first result that comes up is a very good search for finding out the requirements from Google. So I, I really recommend you have a look at that, um, and I'll, I'll just touch on that in a second because it is quite important. But I just want to show you this. I'm done now. My video, I, in terms of, you know, I've, I've just created a whole campaign for my website. And, okay, it took me a bit longer because I had to explain everything to you guys, but you can see here if, you, if you're going to do this again, how quickly you'll be able to create this. It's insane, you know, compared to how long it would take to do all this manually. And 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 so and you're tapping in to some of the highest targeted traffic with Google um, on like the the second most searched you know site in the world. Amazing. Correct. Correct. So it's pretty exciting. Um, now it, it, it might be worth just adding here, um, you know, that you know as with everything, nothing is perfect. And same thing with YouTube ads. Um, I just heard from a friend. He just he was just talking to um, someone from YouTube who is called the YouTube evangelist. I'm not sure exactly, but he's he's very he's in the YouTube ads department as well. But he was saying you know YouTube ads is basically constantly in, in beta. You know, so I think that's something something to keep in mind that um, things don't always work, um, and it's because it's new. But it's the same thing with any other platform. But keep that in mind. You know, this is not. Uh, there's nothing out there that is perfect, and the same goes for for YouTube uh, video ads as well. So, if it doesn't work for whatever reason, it's probably something that you haven't done quite right. Um, but there is also the case where for some niches, it just you know, um, it doesn't doesn't work as well. For example, on Facebook, some professional niches don't work as well. They work better on LinkedIn, um, and, and and vice versa with 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 YouTube. So keep that in mind, um, just as a I guess a bit of a bit of a, a disclaimer as well, but you know, by all means, if your niche is there, there's a lot of um, certainly a lot of traffic to be had. So, so I mean, that's it in terms of setting it up. Um, so, where you can possibly send traffic? I just want to quickly talk about that. How are we doing for time, um, Vic? Should we? I mean, I'll, you know, Gideon, can... this is this. This is really good stuff, man. So you know, let's take let's take as much time as we need. I I really want to make sure that you know that that people get this. Um, okay. I don't want to I don't want to you know cut short on time because I, I, I this is really really good stuff. So I, I people I mean, need to understand. We're pretty much done. I just want to you know I just want to make sure that every, everyone's still with us. But um you know so just want to quickly touch on where you could send traffic potentially. You know so you could think about you could send people to your own YouTube channel, and we're just working on that. Um, template right now that that's designed specifically for that. You could send people to an actual YouTube video if you want. If you want to get more views, boom, just send them to a video. Um, you can send them to a landing page where you collect people's contact details, like I do with Splash Show. Disclaimer: you know it has to be AdWords compliant. Very very important. Um, you can send them to a sales page uh, where you sell a product or service. Once again, make sure it's AdWords compliant. Um, just a word about uh, MLM, affiliate marketing, and, and BizOps, kind of the, the industries there. In general, in the past, YouTube and Google have been a little bit wary of those particular markets. So once again, there, make sure that you, you really go through, um, you know, the, the requirements from from AdWords. So you know, understanding your landing page experience that's so important, and making sure that that you know you're sending people to to the right places. Uh, from your ad, because if you don't, if you send people to a page that YouTube and Google doesn't approve of, um, that you know, obviously they're not going to accept your ad. But in some cases, that you can lose your AdWords account as well if you if you um, if you if you do the wrong thing often enough. <laughs> and I, you know, I think that's just the you know one of the things you've got to um, 
be be careful with with your AdWords account. You want to protect your AdWords account because once you lose it, you you can never get it back. But that's I just wanted to make that point there because I think that's really important. Uh, and, and obviously, there are other industries too. Um, nothing illegal, obviously. Um, as long as you do things above board and you stick to their rules, there shouldn't be any problems at all. So, so you mean people can't like run ads directly, you know, for like Viagra's or like how to make a million dollars in three <laughs> seconds or anything like that? <laughs> that kind of stuff wouldn't fly now, right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I've just realized I haven't had my, my slides up. You've been looking at me looking sideways because I'm looking at my side, slides here, but let me <laughs> just get my slides back up again. Um, I'm not, you know, I normally use uh, YouTube live events, but let me just get my slides up for you again. All right, so I just want to recap. Uh, if you want to do this manually, you know, really painfully slow to search for those channels and videos on YouTube. You saw that. Um, I, I don't. I don't see your slide getting. I just see your picture. Oh, oh that, now I do. Now I do. You're good now. So. Okay. okay now. Good. So, so yeah. Um, painfully slow to search for those things. Um, there's no way to easily find the top channels on on your industry. So I didn't even show you guys that. But if you want to find channels on YouTube and try and rank them by number of subscribers, you can't. You can't do that on YouTube. So with with V-Roll. We've got that tool built in there. I didn't even show you that, but it's pretty cool. Um, now you can spend a lot of money on video production uh, if you know if you have to do it yourself or get someone else to do it for you. Uh, and of course, Vroll, Vroll takes care of that. Um, it helps you get those the video placements and channel placements like instantly. You saw how quickly it was. Um, it helps you create those videos that that are designed to help you convert very very highly. And it completely gets rid of the, the video production stage for you. You just have to type in some text. So you can focus on the marketing side of your business. Um, so we do have, I do have something cool here I'd like, like uh, to invite you to, if, um, and this is only for um, subscribers of Vic. Um, and this, it's access to the whole, the full VRL platform. Um, what you'll get is access to unlimited channel searches, um, unlimited video searches, all the current templates, all the future templates that we that we'll uh, design, the price won't change uh, for this particular offer. Um, all future updates, like we're just about to add some really cool features, like the, the campaign builder. That's gonna, you know, all that stuff I showed you in AdWords. You won't even have to do that. It all gets done in the in the platform. You just click a button and it gets all done for you. So that's coming up. Um, also, there's some. I'm currently doing some live training. Depending on when you sign up for this, it might not be live anymore, but it will, it will be inside the, the members area. You know how to find the exact right target audience, how to create the perfect offer and, and, and video, um, how to correctly analyze your campaigns, how to optimize them, and you know with each one I have a, 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 a at the moment they're live a Q and A session, uh, but obviously those, those are very useful as well for people who, who want to ask more specific questions. So you get access to that as well. Um, how much you know? Think how much you'd normally um, uh, take. You know how much time would it take to get those targets manually? It's a pain. <laughs> um, how much would it take you to create your own video ads? I mean, it's no brainer. Like um, that example I showed you, two to three thousand dollars takes two weeks to create just one video. Um, you know, with Viral you can do it really quickly. Um, so, so what we have, if you go to the Pricing page of of Vroll at the moment. This is what you'll see, and um, the important one to watch there is the the video credits. So the the starter packs uh, four video credits. Um, with the starter one, uh, it, it does come with a Vroll watermark on the videos. So when you upgrade to the pro one, you get ten videos, uh, and there's no watermark anymore. If you're an a, more an agency kind of um, business. You can get 40 credits uh, for video ads. It means you can create 40 videos per month, uh, and, and no no watermarking. What we want to do, uh, if you're a subscriber of Vic, is um, double your credits for the first month. So if I just go back here, so in other words, if you sign up through Vic, uh, just as a courtesy, we'd love to double your credits for the first month. So if you sign up for the starter, you'll get eight video uh, ads per month. The pro, ten new video, uh, twenty new videos per month for that first month. Sorry, it's just this is so it's just doubling it for the first month. Um, so pros, twenty videos for that first month, and then agency will be eighty videos for the first month. So it's, you know, we're basically just doubling what you get for the first month. So, um, so in other words, so in other words, is 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 you know that first month is you you reached a lot of a lot of people. <laughs> 
Yes, stuff. you can right. Stuff. You can create a ton of ads, and 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 yeah. Um, and I mean, the cool thing with these ads as well is that, um, you know, you can if you get the first ad right, you can you don't even need to create all that many more ads. You can. Um, you can get a ton of views and clicks just from one video ad, but obviously if you want to refine it, create more tests and things like that, it's nice to have um, space every month to create more more test ads and, and, and more different campaigns. They will double those uh, for you guys signing up through through Vic. It's just two steps. There'll be Vic. I'm not sure how you want to do this. If there's going to be a link below this video. Um, yeah. Or... So yeah. So so here is here is here is here is the thing, guys. Okay. So. You know, I, I I wanted to bring Gideon on on you know to High Traffic Academy because for a couple of things. Okay, number one is this guy knows video ads. I mean, he, he, you know, he, he pretty much he, he is the leading you know expert that's out there in this kind of stuff in our in our niche. You know, in this in in the area in the, or the world that we live in as far as marketers. Uh, number two is you know. Um, they they have a platform. See, it's, it's one thing about being, you know, it's what's one thing about teaching this stuff or, and actually doing this stuff manually and just kind of grinding all the time. But I'm all about shortcuts personally, you know. Uh, and I I don't want to babysit my business. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to work in my business. I want to work on my business, right? And that's the, the same kind of thinking and you know and and the same kind of like psychology and approach I want to bring to you know all the high traffic academy members here is because you know it's not about just you know, living and, and just kind of grinding your business. It's about working smart and working strategic, right? And so with, you know, in this day and age, I mean, we have tools and shortcuts that we can take uh, that can multiply our results and leverage our time, you know, much on, on, on a big scale. And so uh, Gideon uh, is, is just one of those guys that, you know, he happens to be the expert in this kind of stuff, which I'll clearly, you know, he showed you, you know, how he does it. If you want to do it manually, great. You know, you can right now apply this training and, and do it manually. If you want to, if you're like me, right, if you want to shortcut your, your, your curve, if you want to leverage a lot of the tools, if you want to not think about, you know, how do I create video, how do I, you know, how do I, uh, you know, learn all the psychological triggers in, in, in the video creation, right, to, to get my videos to have a, a higher click-through rates. Um, um, you know, I, I spoke to Gideon. I'm like, you know, Gideon, can we bring your platform to High Traffic Academy as well? And uh, and Gideon, you were talking to me about, you know, you said that you guys are, you know, you're. What I really like about you, man, is 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 how you approach business and how you approach your, you know, your product really and, and your and your platform. And the first thing you told me is like, Vic, depending on how many people we get, you know, we might not be able to service everybody. Uh, and that's a good thing because you guys are all about customer experience and creating, the, you know, creating results. At the end of the day, is for you know, you you guys want people to get results from your service. That's why you you know you test all those templates and you upload only the best ones that perform. Uh, and so you know, I, I spoke to Gideon and I said, look, can we offer your platform to High Traffic Academy members? Uh, and he agreed. So I'm personally very very excited, guys. This is, as you saw, this is the most cutting edge or one of the most cutting edge. You know techniques that you can apply for traffic today, right now. What's going to happen a year from today? You know stuff might change, but as of right now, you know this stuff works. And you know if you're going to be amongst the first one to you know to explore this territory, this is virgin. I mean th you know Google AdWords, uh, you know video ads. This is still kind of in beta. That means huge opportunities, right? There's not a lot of people taking taking advantage of this. If you're gonna be, you know, one of the first ones, man, the, the opportunity is is is, per, I mean, it's, it's unlimited. It's unlimited. Um, so that's that, you know. And and Gideon, I appreciate the, you know, the the generous um, offer that you were able to, you know, put together for High Traffic Academy members exclusively for doubling the credits for the first month. Um, this is one of those things. This is I don't see this as an expense, man. I really this is a, this is a tool. This is a a shortcut. This is like me paying for an autoresponder. You know, I don't have to send out those emails one by one. I just loaded them up, mm -hmm. right? And, and I pay monthly. But but it's 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 a tool. It's one of those tools for your business. And 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 on this is it, it it's gonna allow you know your business to uh, to scale that much quicker. And this is something, guys, that I personally bought. Uh, and you know, Gideon, you know, you offered me a you know a a you know a kind of like a uh, you know, you said, "Hey, I'm I'm just gonna set you up for you know for for testing the system out." And I said, "No, I, I wanna I wanna get this because this is a tool for my business, guys. This is so cutting edge that I'm literally, 
you know, I got it for myself, and I'm and I'm applying this in my business right now, right? So, you know, needless to say, I highly, highly recommend you check this out. Uh, what I'm going to do is right below this video, there's going to be a resource area, and there's going to be a link for you to go and you know and check out. There's a special link for high traffic academy members only. Please do not share this with anybody. It's only for you, okay? And um, another thing I want to talk to you about is is this, and and I want to you know I'm just going to take the opportunity to mention this here is uh, if um, uh, for those of you guys who are High Traffic Academy Elite members, so if you're watching this and you are an elite member, okay, you're in the Elite Mastermind for High Traffic Academy, uh, you get additional discount. Okay, I'm not here, like I don't care about you know bringing you this and, and earning commissions or whatever the thing is, you know, affiliate commission. That's not my deal. My my strategy is to bring you the same tools that I use for my business. Okay, and I'm not. I don't care about making a buck off of you. I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so if you are an elite member, uh, you actually get a discount uh, on this service as well. Okay, so you know again, check it out, um, Gideon. I I appreciate you, man. Any anything anything that that you know anything that you want to add um, before we wrap this up. Really, really good stuff, man. Very, very impressive. Yeah, sure. I mean, just as a, as a final note, if, if, if you do want to sign up and, and get that uh, doubling your credits, just also make sure uh, you send us an email at support at vroll.com. I'll just get that up on the screen um, so that it's clear. And I'm sure you'll, you know, if you can put that on the... Yeah, what um, I'll do is I'll, I'll put the instructions right below the video. Yeah, so you guys can just right below the video, you'll have instructions. Step one, right. two, three, what to do. Yeah, we'll make yeah. it very easy. Brilliant. Okay, and um, yeah, and I mean, you know, we're um, we're very committed to uh, helping you succeed uh, with uh, video ads. Uh, we have a actually we have a 30-day money-back guarantee. So you know, if it doesn't work for you, send us an email. We'll give you money back. It's no problem at all. Um, we have a really good uh, customer support system in place. So if you have any questions, stuck, get stuck with anything at all, there's always going to be someone on standby. Uh, it's not live, but uh, eventually we're planning for it to be live. But you can ask a question, get stuck in, jump on any of the live calls, ask me a question, or ask whoever's doing the training question. Um, really, we just want you to succeed. And so um, we're creating all the opportunities for you to, to succeed. And if you still can't succeed, then we've got the money back guarantee as well. So so, uh, so it really is, you know, we're, we're serious about having customers who get results. So um, it's there for you for the taking. Grab the double credits uh, for the first month if, you, uh, if you're keen. Yeah, awesome. So uh, listen, um, if you need to watch this over again, you know, I know this has been a, you know a, a lengthy uh, module, but I think it's worth it, and, and I'm sure that you, you know, you'll probably be uh, going over a lot of this stuff um, over and over and over again. Learn this, okay? Learn this. Being in the right place at the right time, it's it's big in this industry, and especially with traffic generation, if you're like I, I think back, you know, Google AdWords days and people who were at that time when Google was cool, right, and allowed people to get traffic for eight, ten cents per click. A lot of people made a lot of money. A lot of people generated humongous lists and you know and got very targeted traffic and it was it was cool. You know, it was very easy. Um, I could start an ad, you know, like now and then two two hours later I, my ad would be showing up on, you know, like first Place or second place in Google. Um, this is the same, or, or you know, almost the same opportunity here. It's just a slightly different platform. Very, very cool stuff. So I highly encourage you to apply this. Okay, it's one of those things that, again, if you apply it, I think you'll be very, very happy, pleasantly surprised with this. Um, but um, also, don't just look at this as just a one-time. Okay, so I just I just learned this, so therefore I'm just gonna you know I'm just gonna do what I learned. I highly recommend you stick with an ongoing education with this kind of stuff. Okay, and you know I had an, uh, a conversation with Gideon before you know before this uh, module, and I said, look, you know if anything changes down the road, if there are, there are there any you know algorithm algorithm changes, you know with Google um, AdWords or, or you know video ads, or if there is new features coming out, uh, and you know he agreed to come on uh, for the elite members. So that's where you know really all that continued education happens. So guys, I highly encourage you to check out Elite. If you're not, if you are, great. You know, I'll, I'll, you know obviously we we'll spend a lot of time together on an ongoing basis there. I appreciate you, uh, Gideon. Thank you very much for your time, brother. I appreciate you too, man. Awesome, awesome, awesome stuff. That's all I can say. And uh, you know, again, just you know, you're you're uh, you know, you're you're one of the, you know, for lack of a better word, you're 
badass, man. You know, this is really, really <laughs> amazing stuff. <laughs> Thanks, Vic, for having me. It was, uh, it was good fun. All right. Yeah, look forward to, uh, to you know, hanging out with you more and more. And, uh, and personally, I look forward to implementing this stuff in my business immediately. So, guys, awesome. appreciate you. We'll see you in the next module. God bless and stay awesome. Don't do anything crazy. See you next time.